just in case um, anything starts attacking them. It's going to be to defend here, and possibly here, and some of the like coastal ports in the Med as well. So it's not going to be totally wasted. And we need to, we definitely need to boost the strength of these. This is going to be my aggressive force, so let's put two of those in. And that's it, that's all my experience spent for now. That's fine, let's kick it off. Lots of things to change and upgrade and plan. But now that we're not going to get distracted by this going on, we better pull back from here. Where's our army? Continue attack. Whatever happens, I don't want to get cut off because they will get killed and we do need to get them safely back. I can get a new air doctrine? Yeah, I think I will. Thanks. It's that one, isn't it? Let's go for the direct ground support. Well, I mean, the experience we're gaining from this is going to come in really useful. We need to research a dedicated ground attack plane. I've got an ace pilot in there now as well. That's good. What does that symbol mean? Force attack. Add following effects to the armies for seven days. Defense breakthrough. So here's the thing with France. There's, there's so much uh, pressure to get the... Should I just stop them training for a bit? Stop them training. To get the industry and the economy built up and the forts built, that you really neglect everything else, like the navy, the dockyards, the um, the intelligence agencies and stuff. It's you always feel like you're behind them. The air force, I'm definitely behind on the air force. We've got so now. Right, let's go researching some aircraft now, because we want. We have some close air support. We're just not building any. We're going to need a fighter. And then uh, we just need to wait for this, this mess to finish. Come on, let's speed things up. Where's it going to fail, actually? It almost feels like the Republicans have stabilised the line. If uh, the Reds get knocked out, because I'm assuming these guys fight each other... Things might suddenly look a bit better. Bye. But I am hugely relieved to see forces appearing on this Belgian border now. So begin rearmament. Excellent. Do we want to go down this quickly? Or do we want to... Do we want to try and push for this? I do want to get this uh, alliance done. We've got... We've got the Czechoslovakia. We need to get everybody else in as well, don't we? Mm, no, I think I really do need to at least get the initial get that done before I work on the rest of it. So we'll go for this one. This one even. It does lock us into a particular line there, and I like the look of the other line, especially with the artillery stuff, but hey, we're going to go for it. Yeah, we definitely want defences in the Arden Forest. We're not going to get caught out by that old chestnut. What was that? We have... Uh, right, nice. It was support companies, wasn't it? Support equipment. It's holding us up. And let's get the infantry done. We, we just need infantry sat on the front line. That's the most important thing. Modify the officer corps. Nope, I need to save my little points. Ooh, that could have gone bad if I wasn't paying attention. Right, we're going to pull back. We're not going to pull back, are we? <laughs> we are going to pull back. I'm not getting caught up in that lot. We're going to sit in this port. We are going to be the people defending this port. So when this fails... I better be careful. I do not get surrounded here. Italy announces claims on Yugoslavian territory. Indian National Congress triumphs on provincial elections. Never seen that change anything in India. 
in any game I've ever played. Right, we could hold those off at bay for like ever. But this, this war is definitely decided. <laughs> Tony LMAO, welcome to the stream. Thanks for the follow. Yeah, if you're interested, by the way, there's a great YouTube channel called World War II. And it's got one of these week-by-week -week commentaries uh, of what happened in the war in that week. Oh, sorry, in this week, 70, 80 years ago. Definitely worth watching. They had the Great War um, channel that they did for World War I, and it was so successful, they did a World War II one. And uh, it's so, so just bursting with information of things that you'd never hear about in, most, in a lot of the history books. It's really worth looking into. Realising a strategic weakness, the Yugoslavian Air Force has initiated a crash programme to modernise and expand its forces. Significant money reserves have been set aside to cover the purchase. A commission is travelling around Europe to look for new sources of fighters and medium bombers. Given the urgency of the issue, the Yugoslavians have, instructed, have insisted on immediate delivery or transfer of planes directly from the producer. We could sell bombers. We've got some tactical bombers, which I don't want. Nice, that will help with consumer goods and fighter production. Uh, which grants fighter production costs plus 10% for 120 days. I don't think I want that. No, I want the consumer goods. But I still get that. Oh, let's sell the bombers. Let's sell the bombers. Ooh, we've got this as well. Nice. Methodical battle. Yeah, come on. We've got to, we've got to fire, fire down to this. Come on. Power down. Get that. And then we're in a good position. Yeah, so you're saying now things would have been different if the French had defended the Arden Forest. Uh, they actually did, did defend part of it, but the guy in charge withdrew um, or didn't position his troops where he should and then withdrew far too early away from it, leaving a massive opening for the Germans to exploit. There's a, this is done, is it? Oh, no. No, that bit's been done. Okay. So there's a lot of stuff happened in that early part of 1940 that uh, you don't really hear about in the general history books. There's really interesting stuff. What else do we need? Trucks were doing okay. Trains were doing fine. I'll leave that as it is, like, forever. The light tanks. No, I'm not too worried about them. The artillery, maybe. Let's get the support equipment in check just so I can get troops on the front. Equity. Nice. We are starting to power up now. You guys are training? <laughs> no, you're not. Why are you not training? Right. Why is nobody training? Train, train boys, train faster, harder. We need the experience for one thing. Long. And the cavalry. A guerrilla fighter, go on, I'll take it. It is quite useful still, being able to entrench a bit faster. So like the French also managed a huge counterattack against the Germans which was planned to go in with British help, but I think the British saw the writing up was on the wall and pulled back to Dunkirk instead. And then the French afterwards blamed the British for dropping them in it, but um, I don't know, it's, uh, it was a bad situation regardless. But there's loads of interesting stuff like that. So uh, World War II channel on YouTube, highly recommended. I watch it so much. I'm at the point now where I've caught up with all the weekly episodes, so I can't wait for every Saturday for the next one to come out. Right, we're in 38. There's got to be more building stuff. Unless I go for that a year early, which is silly. But there should be some technology, so we'll get this one on. We have another air doctrine. Okay. Let's go for... Let's go for that. We may as well. Formation fighting. Air superiority mission efficiency. Or fighter ace initiative. Ace generation chance. We'll go for that one. Right, folks. It's now it's a bit easier to see who's training as well, I think. They've got these little symbols next to them. I'm, that's new. There's a lot of stuff added new. Should I recruit? Should I um, research those simpler trains? And then... No, that's it. too far ahead. We won't do that yet. What else do we need? What else? Uh, that cavalry 
Okay, I'll need to edit the cavalry template to make uh, garrison units before I add a load of artillery in. So let's go for... Medium tanks are better than lights, so we should start working those up to get something good. And still too early for the better guns. The planes we're going to catch up on. The, the plan is we're just going to go for fighters and close air support. Oh, and a few naval bombers as well, because we, we can't spare the factories to have a diverse air force, I think, in this. There's so much we're behind with. But uh, yeah, we don't want to make too many light tanks because mediums are the future. Yeah, okay, I'll try that old world blues if I ever do try a mod. There's, there's that one and there's the Kaiserite mod, which uh, I'd also like to try. Hungary demands the right to rearm. Nope, they caused trouble before. They plunged the world to war already. We stand firm on rearmament. They can go to hell. So Austria is being taken over by the Germans. That's not good. Italy's abandoned the naval treaty. Surprise, surprise. We're still fighting on down here. We will hold this port to the last baguette. All right, we're getting some decent stuff coming out now. I am going to put some extra resources into these so we can really get the support equipment out. That's, that's, that's what we need um, because that's holding us back a little bit. We always need plenty. Modify the government. Let's change that to... So we've got 35% consumer goods. Uh, it'll help a little bit. Military factory construction speed. I'd like to go straight to that, but... I do feel like we need to make a change to try and get the, uh, yes, to try and get this up as much as possible. We're on the forts now. Excellent. That's going in the right direction now. All right, let's build. Let, let's interrupt this uh, fort building program. To get a couple more military factories, because it'd be really nice to get some aircraft up in the sky as well. But I'm suddenly feeling more confident we're going to get there in time. So you learned a lot about Hungarian history while you were there. They were under the heel of the Austrians for quite a while. Hungarian, the Austro-Hungarian Empire was a, a major like powerhouse of Europe at one point. Japan abandons the naval treaty. Yeah, I think I can see where they're going with all that. We are going to need more civilian factories at some point because we're going to need to trade some of this stuff away. And I'm also going to need to train up some weaker guys as well. So we've got... Attention. So I need another 12 of those divisions. And we need stuff to go and hold on to our islands and defend the ports as well. So we're going to need all of this. Free dockyards. Excellent. We have some naval experience. But not a lot. Is it enough to go and build or modify... Oh, I'm going to need... Oh, I'm going to need convoys going in, aren't I? Can we get... Uh, what if I edit that? To have... Right, hang on, back. Does it go back? Let's... Um, how do I duplicate this? Uh, upgrade all modules. Auto design. Save, save as new. When saving this design, create a new design for free. The original design will remain unchanged. You can continue using it as you deploy the new... Right, that's what I want. So I want to go for mine laying tubes on there. And torpedo tubes on the back. That's fine. And do we want to use a cheap engine? What about range? Probably put a basic engine in. Reliability minus 20%. Fuel usage 7. If I put it up to 2. Fuel usage 8. Let's leave it at the cheap rubbish things right then save as new do we not get to call it something because i'd really like to call it something different can we see it in there has it gone to the top of the list nope can you see the thing i've just created i can't it's not that Is it that? It's not that. 
Let me just close that. Did I actually... It's not spent the XP. Okay. <laughs> What's that all about then? Hang on a sec. Has it saved the design? Hmm. It doesn't seem to have... Right. Let's try this again. So if I put save as new... Right. And then close that. Do we have two of them? Do I have to give it a different name? Redoubtable class. Right, I'm just going to call this mine subs. I can't seem to get this to do what I want. Put um, mine warfare in there and give it the cheap engine and then go save as new. Save. Have we got it? It's definitely spent it this time. Yeah, it has. It's up the top there. That's good. Uh, let's put... Uh, how many spare of these do we have? See, I'm not really interested in more heavy ships. So... <laughs> they can they can just go on the back burner for a while. But let's, let's get some mine subs out. And they can reappear in... Uh, yeah, that'll do. We, have, we do have 63 submarines over here. I mean, these things are going to be absolute garbage and they're going to get, like, sunk really fast. But um, we'll get some mine subs going. We want some, some decent attack subs as well. Let's change the... Let's change the symbol for these. Put that onto... Yeah, that'll do. That looks awful, that colour. Actually, skull and crossbones is good. That's probably easier to see. Uh, but definitely change the colour. France Fleet 3. Uh, let's have... Do we have any submarine experts in this? What have we got? Spotting speed, battleship adherent... Gentlemanly and aircraft controller positioning, positioning chance to receive a critical hit minus five percent. Uh, you'll do. I don't think you have any particular submarine skills, but we'll definitely go concealment and smoke screen retreat decision. I don't know that that really works with a sub, it might be what we want. Does that work on subs? Welcome back, Mike. What's my favourite game? My favourite game of all time is Witcher 3. I think it's the, the best written, the best made game ever. I, I just, uh, from a story perspective, that is. I absolutely love it. I love the way it was done. It was the first Witcher game I played as well. Methodical battle, so we definitely set ourselves in for this. And fortification focus. This is this is where we get this. So, once I've got that, um, we might spend a little bit. Of, we're in thirty-eight though. I I oh, I want I need those um, I need those alliances. I definitely need those alliances. That's next. I'm going for alliances next. I'm starting to feel the pressure of not being quite ready. Bobby. Send those to Toulon. The light tanks. We have the aircraft. <laughs> we have nothing in production, but we have the aircraft. So that's the main thing. April 38. We'll go with Radar. Infantry stuff. Marines. Marines we can do without just for now. Tanks. We're working on tanks. We better start working on something for our new medium tanks, which is going to be a while off. I feel like there should be something else. Yeah, let's get, uh, let's get sonar and stuff. We're going to need our destroyers to be on the ball because there'll be German subs everywhere. What time is it? Half seven. See if we, we'll probably get to the start of uh, the proper start of 
a conflict in tonight's stream, I suspect, and then continue it tomorrow. Bye. Just slowly adding more men onto that front line. Écoutez. <laughs> We're not at full strength yet, but hopefully we'll be enough to dissuade the Italians from attacking. Bye. I think all the cavalry is going to be sent to... Um, Probably to North Africa. Hmm. We no longer get the effects from seized Spanish gold reserves. That's a shame, because I enjoyed using those. We have held the port. <laughs> we have held to the bitter end. These troops. Come on, let's, let's, let's have the selection. Wait, am I getting destroyed? Did I order something out? Have I lost something over there? Uh, something's been destroyed. Okay, can you not retreat? I'll see if I can actually get out of there because there's no benefit to us anymore. Uh, I think we might lose those divisions. I'm surprised to see one's been destroyed. I wonder if it got caught up somewhere else where I wasn't watching. Anyway, we've got the fortification focus. Are we going straight for the Alpine forts? No, we're going to try and get uh, the um, agreement to destroy the Germans. We'll go for the Polish alliance. Poland's at risk of... Yeah, Poland's at risk of getting invaded next. And we'll get Yugoslavia and Romania in as well. And we should have a nice little um, faction. It'll all get conquered by the Germans, but that's fine. The longer they can hold out, the better for me. <laughs> it's kind of a, a brutal way of thinking about it, but what does this mean? Staff office plan. Really annoyed that uh, I've lost something there. Oh, is there no way of actually escaping? I don't think there is. Anyway, this this war is over. Just just finish it now, please. Just surrender, and let us get some troops back. We gained some great experience out of it. Ah, that reminds me. We've got some experience to spend there. So we need to duplicate this, the cavalry division, at that point. Yep, let's uh, duplicate that. This is a copy of cavalry, and we're going to call this garrison divisions. I don't intend making any, but this will be what I use to set as the garrison division because it'll be more effective in suppression. And they, I assume that's still the case. Um, let's change the symbol as well to one of those. They don't need cavalry recon detachments for these, but I don't want to waste the points to remove them. But I'll swap them over for some military police when the time comes. That's what I'll do. And that can be on that. So, update. And that's, that should have done a second one. It has. Excellent. So now we go into this. And this, and this, and we switch to the garrison divisions because that should have, I should have better suppression, manpower per suppression, 541. The tanks actually work quite well at suppressing people, but uh, yeah. And when we put the military police unit in there, that'll be better. And that should free up more equipment and manpower for the other more important tasks as well. I think that's how it all works anyway. Another ace pilot promoted. Where are they? Because are they still in? Do we still have? They're still fighting to the bitter end. Nice. Doing a good job there, folks. They really have helped. Oh, we can do another one of these. Right, pause. That's not good. Uh, Germans are justifying war against us. Okay. It really is all kicking off now. Trucks are looking better. The artillery is looking acceptable. That's about to sort itself out. Finally, the equipment is coming good. We, we're going to need more light. What else do we need? What else do we need? What, what am I not producing that I should be? Nothing too essential. 
We're going to need some medium tanks. Oh, aircraft. Let me get the aircraft on. I want naval bombers as well. Damn it, to help control the Mediterranean. But I definitely need some fighters. But I, I feel like I'm going to create so few that uh, it's not really going to be worth the bother. But we need to start it for sure. Doctrine's available. Yes. Let me go for... It is only the Air Force, isn't it? So we really race down here. Hunt and destroy. <laughs> we need to make some ground attack aircraft. Oh god, that's another thing we desperately have to do. Attention. Undersigned divisions. Come on. Get on that front line with uh, with Belgium. I'm a little bit concerned about this spot. We're, we're going to have forts there. It's, it's going to be fine. Actually, we're doing quite well with the fortress production. So, with that in mind, I'm going to add these on. It really is a race to get ready, playing as France. Hope I haven't missed anything out there. Big gaping hole in the line. <laughs> to be fair, the German justification for declaring war in World War II was, you're not German. It's about right. Okay. Yugoslav air purchase has gone through. Missing equipment. Um, tactical bomber, that's, that's okay. We, we don't care too much about that. But we do want depth charge launchers and stuff for the for the destroyers we're in 38 um, I could try and push for that early would it help at this point I mean it's always going to help yeah I think so I don't feel like there's anything else I need to rush towards in 38 we've got these but we just don't have Enough of the um, factories to build them. I mean, that is going to be important, but we can probably put that on the back burner for a bit. The military police thing is, it can be done now, but there's no huge benefit to it yet. Again, I feel like I can hold off on that. Okay, so, with that being the case, Shall I go for... I'm going to go for this. I'm going to get the construction up. It's... it's. We get a bit of a penalty for it, but let's, let's go for it regardless. So, France, are you ready? Because it will be kicking off soon. So, we lost. We lost the Spanish Civil War. That's a real shame. I can put troops back on training now. Let's get these... Um... Oh, hang on, we've got... What have we got here? Oh, we've got the extra light cruisers. Excellent. Put those into the big... Just pause a second. Put those in there. And then we've got two subs, which can go in there. And then we've got two destroyers, which will go in there. We kind of need to get things trained up a bit. And then we've still got five... Are these the mine subs? No, these... Yes, they are. I need to change the symbol for that, otherwise I'm going to forget. That's uh, that's going to be a mess, isn't it? So where are the mine subs? 